welcome to sap tm technical training my name is karthik i am the trainer for this tm technical training and this course duration is 30 hours and this course training is based on tm embedded escohana look at the course overview who can attend this course this course is designed for abap developers any tm technical consultant functional consultant or technical architect solution architect or any other you know project team members once you complete this course you will learn floor plan manager bopf framework post processing framework and personal object work list these frameworks are also used in other sap applications such as uh, ewm event management environment health and safety supplier relationship management supplier network collaboration and this course is primarily designed for sap tm but from the frameworks perspective the same frameworks are also used in some of the other sap applications so wherever you have this compatibility of these frameworks uh, then you know uh, this knowledge and experience can be used in other modules also after you complete this course you get the it understanding and uh, you know deep knowledge of all the primary frameworks and also supporting framework and then uh, i would also focus both from tm implementation perspective and a tm support perspective that if we are talking about any specific framework what kind of real time requirements would come in from the implementation or from the support but if you are working in implementation what should be your solution approach or if you are in the support project you know how do you proceed with the troubleshooting or you know how do you uh, investigate the issue so we would also focus wherever uh, there is a relevant requirement relevant topic that we keep focusing both from implementation perspective as well as support perspective but if you are going to work as a tm functional consultant this training will definitely help you to understand the architectural perspective of sap tm say for example you are a functional consultant you may be accessing forwarding order freight order freight booking but you never know what is the technology behind these applications now this training will give you that opportunity to understand what is the framework behind the application that you are working with and what is the architectural fundamentals behind the application that you are working with and uh, you will understand how the data is flowing from front end to the back end and uh, you know how does the uh, create application work edit application work and display application work so all these modes you being a functional consultant you are definitely responsible for writing the functional specifications if you know little bit of abap you can also become techno functional consultant and you can also write efficient functional specifications and uh, if you are from the sap tm uh, technical consultant if your career path is going to be uh, doing some custom developments or custom enhancements in the sap tm system definitely this course is very much relevant for you if you are going to work as a sap tm technical consultant if you are responsible for writing the code into your system then uh, abap is very much prerequisite for you uh, then uh, if if that is there rest of the things that is needed for sap tm uh, technical development will be covered in this uh, training so that that's all from the uh, tm functional consultant and a tm technical consultant how this training is going to help you then moving on to the participant instruction ptm technical uh, training which is conducted online and uh, we do uh, cover both from theory as well as practical scenario based training so first you know without knowing the theory we cannot directly jump into the practical because if you don't know the terminology if you don't know what are the various processes or various steps involved in realizing any uh, uh, enhancement or custom development it's of no use you cannot follow what i am doing practically so therefore first we will spend bare minimum time in understanding the 
technical architecture the framework concepts then you know we will for every framework we will have at least one practical scenario we will also go through the course content i will walk you through the course content i i hope you all must have seen already but the classes will be on every saturday and sunday the session duration will be you know approximately one and a half hour to two hours then at the end of the uh, sap tm technical training you will get these documents uh, shared online the sap tm technical step by step guide document will be shared with you that is prepared by me then i will also share another document uh, that is sap helpful links here in sap helpful links i have split those links into scenario based framework based and uh, this sap helpful links not only focused from sap tm technical perspective but also from sap tm functional as well so people who are from sap tm functional they still get some valuable links from this document and this document will also help you if you are preparing for certification i have also given you the links which can take you to the uh, uh, you know right target path where you can get enough information about how to prepare for the certification or etc then uh, another document paul step by step guide also you will get it uh, and a bopf also then you can just uh, look through this document and this document bopf for learners specifically covers about bopf concepts and uh, this document will cover all the concepts of bopf and it will give you you know just in case if there are any gaps this document can fill those gaps okay so that that these four documents you will get it at end of the training or just in case if you miss the session due to any valid reason you don't have to worry uh, i will record every session and uh, if you miss any session i will share the recording with you you can just go through those recording and if you have any questions and i will clarify then uh, yeah so this is most important i don't encourage anybody doing any recordings of these online trainings yeah so this is a, a, a serious disclaimer we start the introduction about sap tm okay and uh, we also see uh, some tm functional overview so we do very high level functional overview just one session only uh, and then we will also spend some time in getting into the system to see how the application look like those who are getting into sap tm system for the first time then it will help them to understand i would also give you what are the various frameworks that are involved in sap transportation management then we go into the sap tm technical deep dive so this is the primary focus of this sap tm technical training so i hope most of you have already gone through this course content uh, yeah so we talk about sap transportation management introduction then we talk about functional overview yeah so this is the sap tm technology stack technical frameworks so floor plan manager is the front end framework so floor plan manager is the framework which is used for uh, you know designing and developing front end applications front end web ui so this is the primary framework which is used as front end so we talk about this floor plan manager framework uh, this is also called as configurable user interface i have one slide dedicated for uh, what are the various front end frameworks available in sap and what are the differences between those frameworks so that's where you will come to know how the sap transportation management specific web ui is different from other user interfaces okay so then uh, fbi framework fbi stands for floor plan manager bopf integration yeah then this is this acts as a, a middle layer between front end and back end then we have 
a backend framework called BOPF business objects processing framework so here you see this uh, we talk about architecture how do we model the business objects and what are the important transaction codes and we talk from the implementation perspective and enhancements perspective right and we have hands-on scenarios as well so for floor plan manager after we complete the floor plan manager framework so we do this practical scenario one so here we are going to create a custom floor plan manager application but we reuse some of the fbi view configurations and sap tm bopf objects so this practical scenario will help you just in case if you come across with a, a real time requirement wherein customer has asked you to develop a complete new application altogether then we have practical scenario 2 so to start with practical scenario 2 we must complete the theoretical part of bopf so then only we can go with the practical scenario 2 okay then another most important practical scenario 3 this is also based on very real time requirement we create a bo enhancement bopf then tm standard ui enhancement so do not miss the sessions where we talk about practical scenario 2 and practical scenario 3 post processing framework this is another framework which is associated with output management tab of every tm application you go to forwarding order you will encounter output management you go to freight order you will see output management tab in that application so here in the output management we do two activities one is a form printing another is proxy triggering proxies are web services so we will also talk about post processing framework how do we trigger the proxy how do we trigger the web service or how do we trigger how do we print the adobe forms how you can mail a document how you how you can fax it etc all that perspectives it is one framework post processing framework then we also talk about some enhancement techniques baddies you how can you efficiently find the helper classes how helper classes will help you in sap transportation management world and uh, we also talk very little about performance and optimization analysis throughout the course duration if we are talking about floor plan manager i will tell you what kind of interview questions you may face and for that question how should you be ready with an answer based on every framework i will cover all these tips and interview questions that's all about the course content